Hello, welcome to Kentucky Brew Review. I'm Pax Sun. Special K, and tonight we're doing Founders Bottle Shop series. Uh, this is Nemesis, release number one. Uh, this is part of the new series that they're doing. Uh, Nemesis is, uh, no, uh -oh. it's a barley one. Oh, it's a barley one. <sighs> barley ones taste like horse barns. I didn't even know this that was barnyard a taste, baby. Man, well, we're I gonna hate. figure out what it's all about. The only beer that I have problems normally with are barley wines, but I'm gonna give a fair review on it the best I can. Uh, barley wine. Have you had a barley wine before? Um, I've had one, but it was a long time ago. I don't think I liked it. It's 11.2 percent. So oh, so it's it's up there. It's 11.2 beer. It's kind of expensive for for founders Look beer, but that. it's you know four ish Dollar. dollars a bottle. Um. With a hint of like a maybe a red copper esque. It does sort of smell like a horse barn. I know what you're saying. It's got like that um hay bale. But dirty, like dirt, shitty dirt, hay, dirty, hay. Dirty shitty hay. Let's go. Like, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be crude. I'll just call it dirty hay. Sorry, we're fishing. Yeah. We're fishing right now, guys. Action. We've got four fishing poles out while we're doing videos, which is probably not. There's that bird I was talking the about. Smartest. He's uh, hanging out up there. Smartest move, but uh, you know we'll be all right. We we gotta we gotta have some fun while we're doing videos, right? See, I also got fishy fingers, so I can't tell if I'm smelling. Well, the you fishy gotta go fingers. low. Yeah, I'm yeah. going low. Um, it smells a little bit like a cream I soda. I cannot place this smell. It's a little bit like a cream soda, like an old school cream soda, but it also has a lot of barnyard like barn funk so like does it have a woody smell to you i get like some a little kind of bit woody yeah smell. like sarsaparilla it almost yeah. reminds me of like sarsaparilla yeah maybe something. like a yeah. sarsaparilla let's taste it yep that's a barley wine whoa that makes me just that hikes my eyebrows up that is in fact a barley wine all right because i've had maybe one barley wine in my life well they're bitter they're bitter. Ooh, there's like a cho there's like a very slight chocolatey aftertaste that shows up way later. That's the only part I like. IBUs are. It says there's 74 IBUs on this. It tastes way higher than that. Yeah. Um, it's got a little bit of a. It's got that horse barn funk in it. It's a little sweet. It's got a little wood on the back end. Um, and a little malty, a little barley forward. It's not. I don't like it. Who likes these? I don't know. Because you are a, a person of niche taste these are interesting. funk yeah they funk uh i'm confused as to why founders decided to start a brand new series and this be the first beer that they do mm. um so the bottle shop series nemesis this is my nemesis there uh right. for beers uh, if i had to pick a beer my least favorite style of beer it would definitely be um barley wines this one oh, wow uh, it's it's a little more hot forward than I'm used to, and I've had quite a few barley wines, and most barley wines I've had haven't been this hot forward, and it's a little off-putting. It still has all of the barley wine funk that you're into, so if you like barley wines, it has that barnyardy hay horse barn flavor. It has a little bit of woody characteristic. It has all that funk. It's a little bit sweet, a little bit vanilla-y. Yeah, I think it says something when I want to try it again, because I'm still like, I can't place this taste, Perplex. but but I don't want to try it again, because I'm like, do I want to go for another ride? Oh, God, okay. I, I gave it a fair read because even though personally I don't like barley wines, I think this one's it's still too bitter. Yeah. Uh, and too and, and again, keep in mind I drink you know I'm drinking triple IPAs and all this other stuff on the show regularly. Yeah. The bitterness on this one it just doesn't work very well with this style of beer in my opinion. Um, Man, I'm so out of my element because this is. I'm be honest because I don't like. It. Do you? No, you I don't, don't like, like it at all. I don't like it either. But I'm like maybe that's what it's supposed to be. I've never had a barley wine that was this hot this, forward. This, yeah, it is. I thought that was a clicker for a minute. Extra hoppy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've never had Not a barley excited. wine that is this that's this hot forward. Uh, it's a little little much for me personally. Uh, mm -hmm. That being said, uh, it has a lot of the characteristics of barley wine minus that really heavy hot forwardness. Uh, I'm gonna give it a three. Three. I don't like it. Um, Which one is the one where you're like, I don't even want to try, I, do, I, won't, I won't do this ever again? Is that one, two? Uh, one is, it's so, I'm going to bomb it. Two, oh, two, three okay. would be, I would unhappily drink it. That's uh, where I'm at. Three okay. is, unhappily I would unhappily drink. drink it. That says it perfectly. Uh, I will unhappily drink this like I am right now. Yeah, I'm unhappily <laughs> drinking this beer. 
Maybe maybe I give it a three and a half for the benefit of the doubt that maybe this is just that barley wine ness with extra hops. So if you want that, the fish gods you want to beat your freaking taste buds up. The fish gods need to give us a catfish now that we have agreed. I don't know. Would this be good with like something strong to like follow up with? Like I mean, a, if you enjoy know. eating hay, <laughs> yeah. or horse shit, <laughs> yeah, yeah, there I you mean, go. It's it's not good. Like yeah. Again, if you like barley wine styles, I still think this is too hot forward. For a typical barley wine maybe it's just what they were going for like a really hot poured barley wine yeah maybe but all the barley wines i've had like norwal and all those other ones have not been or uh, sorry bigfoot bigfoot and stuff like that have not been this hot forward it's just it's just too much okay they're typically high abvs but they're not this yeah gotcha. just, and i can't recommend it what about you excuse me could i recommend it mm. no that's just pers yeah. my personal opinion, because I wouldn't tell anyone to try this. And then someone out there who's a barley wine lover would be like, you're an idiot, and you'd probably be right. But no, I can't, I couldn't tell anyone to try this. Maybe it's like a, a fuck with them. Oh, yeah, he like, tries beer, it's yeah, great. Yeah, you take a big chug it. Chug it. If, yeah. you took, if you smacked this whole glass, you would... Yeah, you would... It, You'd get that, like, your You'd toes would up curl. Your and, yeah, 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 it would yeah. be, it'd be a rough one. It would be rough. Yeah. All right, well, that has been our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, you can leave a comment down below. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook, Patreon, and Instagram. I'm Special K. And I'm Paxson. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.